We are very excited about our next guest, yes, Lucy Hill, who is known for performances in Pretty Little Liars, The Hating Game, and Truth or Dare. Now she's starring in the romantic comedy, which brings me to you. The film follows two Jada singles who meet at a wedding and decide to share all of their messy romantic histories in order to see if they could be the perfect pair. Hale plays Jane, a freelance journalist, who is, let's say, reluctant to open up. You never forget your first heartbreak, that's for sure. Mm -hmm. What was yours? <laughs> no, no, we don't need to get into all that, trust me. You know what? I want my pie back. What? Yeah, just feeling hungry and I think I want some pie. Are you reneging on your pie offer? I'll make you a trade, okay? I'll give you some of this pie if you tell me your first heartbreak. Can I get you another slice? No, no, I think we're all right. <laughs> Seems like a fair exchange to me. Lucy Hale, what's up? Hi. How you doing? Good I realize morning. I have the same hair today as yes. I do in the movie. Yeah. Consistent totally look. Unintentional, but very consistent. Very yeah. consistent. Thank you for joining very us. Very pretty pink today. That's very right. Pretty pretty backdrop. Today. Just for you, so as wonderful. Gail likes to say. Just for you, Lucy. Um, Guys. This story, it jumps around in yeah. different timelines. What is it like to play a character in different phases of her life? Gail and I were talking about this because Gail was so sweet and you said you love the movie and I appreciate mm -hmm. it so much. But we were saying like the movie starts how usual rom-coms end. So it starts with the couple getting together and then they're like, whoa, I really care about you. I'm really vibing with you, but like I need to disclose who I am as a person to be really yeah. transparent. So they go back and relive all of their major loves, major heartbreaks. So I got to play ages like 16 to 30 mm -hmm. and we get to see both characters throughout their lives, which was really fun to play. Lucy, I love how you say uh, they're getting together. They're <laughs> boinking in the coat closet at they a wedding. They are as, getting as, together. As, as, as yeah. one does. Yes. I, I was raised As one does. I personally have not done that, but good I for know. them, right? I, I just want, now I want to know about Gail's coat closet. <laughs> right. I, know. I know, I'm like, do tell us, Gail. <laughs> no. We're waiting. Well, yeah. <laughs> Only because, Lucy, I was raised in a house where my grandmother actually said this, a man doesn't buy the cow if he can get the milk for free, which uh -huh. when you look at it is so wrong on so many levels. Right, on, on right, many, many right. levels. But I was raised in a house like that. And so I'm thinking, how could this possibly end up with the two of them together? How could this possibly work out? Yeah. A one night stand, how could it possibly work but out? But also yeah. the thing about it telling all of your demons up front, mm. which I think is an interesting premise. And scary. Yeah, what do you think about I that? I fully subscribe to that in my real life as well. You do? I think, yeah, I Tell, mean, warts no and games. Bring the skeletons out of the closet, be yeah. yourself, and the people who stick around for you, romantic or otherwise, they'll always be there. The Those people, are the real ones. Yeah, otherwise. But what if it scares them off before you get yeah. started? Yeah, before you start. I don't want a man who's scared of me anyway. So <laughs> I feel like if they're scared, they don't belong there. But I think that Jane in the movie feels that way as well. She's like really damaged. I think Will is also really damaged. And I feel like their relationship might might not be the healthiest, but like at least they're being really Honest. Yeah, I love that. I think it's great. Did you did. find in your own life that were there were any moments that you went back to uh, that you recalled in your any own? people any any relationships I'd like to relive? Absolutely not. <laughs> Absolutely not. You take the wins, you learn from each relationship, but no, I think those chapters are um There's not one that got away that you think uh, No. I no. Good riddance. I don't not good I mean to some good riddance, <laughs> but to some I'm friends with, but yeah. No, no, I don't long for past But Lucy, past the, the great thing about you, and kudos to you, because you're very open and honest as you are in this movie, but you recently shared on, on Instagram about two years of sobriety. Yeah. Has that been difficult for you? And I, I appreciate that you opened up the way that you did oh. to share something that's so personal. I, you know, it had been a long journey of trying to find a way that worked for me, but difficult as far as talking about it? No, no. like it, 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 it all seamlessly happened. It, all, it felt very authentic and natural for me to be open in that way. I think, once again, transparency, like yes. showing up as myself yes. is yeah. like the biggest gift because I used to be afraid of that, but I've just been welcomed with so much love and warmth and it's been really beautiful to be able to be myself. We can also say Lucy Hill actress, actor. We can also say Lucy Hill executive producer. Mm -hmm. Yes, we I can. Watched, I also wear that hat. Yeah, and yeah. Then the credits said Lucy Hill and uh, along with Nat Wolf, yeah. executive producer. What's the yeah. difference for you between being an actor and also executive producing in this particular project? I think for this particular project, we got to, me and um, Nat and our director, Peter, we really molded the script. So we got to make creative 
um, choices involving like dialogue and character and casting and wardrobe. So it's it's for me, it's just like being involved with the entire process from the, yeah. the very beginning. So. Well, I'm yeah. not gonna tell people how it ends because it takes a lot of twists and turns and I'm wondering how how is this couple gonna make it? I'm still wondering about your coat club. <laughs> oh! <laughs> <laughs> Lucy, I am such a square, but it is hard out here for a pimp, but I really <laughs> am. Damn. I really am a big square. That's a good left turn. I love this interview. Welcome Lucy's to Fifty gonna, Shades uh, of CBS Morning. Yes. <laughs> Lucy's going to executive produce her next yes. work, yes. Gail's Coat Sorry, Closet. Gail's Coat Closet. Yes. Gail's yeah. Coat Closet. Oh, that yeah. sounds like a good book. Yeah. Uh, thank you so much, thank Lucy. Thank you for having me. Congrats, Lucy. Lucy. Thank now you can so see much. which brings me to you in theaters this Friday. Yes. As Gail says, run, don't, don't walk. walk.